Good stuff. <laughs> yeah. Good stuff, Muska. Alright, we have Scraddles versus Flow Rats now. That was a good cool one. Set. Now we're hitting two foxes. Uh, Flo is a, famously a uh, chic player that's just been grinding foxes. And it's a really weird kind of fox. See, he like, plays fox like somebody else would play big, uh, play chic. And so it makes it fun to play against. But, I mean, Brad Straddles is probably the most fun fox to play against. He does really goofy shit all the time. in a bit. Whoever made Fox's face is <laughs> strong. He's a monster. <laughs> you see him walking? We were talking about this before the tournament started. How much like walking is like the middle ground of movement? Like I know that sounds really dumb, but like I know walking changes like if you try and implement it, like walking on platforms. Instead of just dashing, like, it gives you my perspective on your head otherwise. It's really good for this Yeah, Brad, <laughs> Brad whips his head. <laughs> they look like they're having fun. You love to see it. <laughs> what the fuck was that? <laughs> Alright, come on, this play. Really clean. Flo 
so. Uh, Alright, is that better? Alright, this is, uh, it's pretty close. <laughs> I just don't want to blow people's ears up. Lose semis, good point. Yeah, I did fuck that up. Yeah, I, th I think Brad really hit his stride there. Though. Getting back into it, getting his confidence back. He did SD on that first stop, which is it's always a huge hit to the to your confidence when you SD on a tournament. It really stings. Like I can deal with the last stop SD, but not a first stop SD. That just fucks up the rest of your game. Look at that, man. The shield, I, this is something that's kind of new, like shield pressuring from, uh, from below, like hitting with those up airs. Because usually I just expect like a shield drop to get back there, a shield drop is shine. Yeah, he read that grab, got him with a cheeky little combo. Nice job. He's playing a lot for me now. He's close to the first game. Wow. That's, that was a punish and a half. Since when did Fox is starting to start doing up airs? Like all the time. Like for, for any punish. Yeah. <laughs> if it didn't get it out. So. It's like a, a hidden boss in uh, New York, I think his name's Aqua, and he does this thing on FOD where, I think it's called like the Dingo Drop or something, where you run up to like the ledge and then you turn around and shield on like the, the same frame and like very close to each other, and you just snap the ledge and it, oh, instantly, wow, good shine. I love watching Brad, man. He's very... Like... He's not super fast, but he's still reasonably fast. Yeah. And he has his dumb. He's very good at punishing horizontally. That's always cool. Yeah. But people love, like... He's just he's people love Mango for drag, because he, like... Yeah. Punishes horizontally all the time. And also, Mango's such a personality. Yeah. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Mango's laugh is, like... Into the back of my head. It sounds like someone's scraping like a like an already clean plate. It's like a like, um, oh. Yeah, well he's incredible at the game, so he, he he's warranted that love. Look, yeah. look, look, it's it's you know you should never should talk someone's laugh because you know at the end of the day them laughing, them smiling, it's a, yeah, you know, exactly. it's a beautiful good, thing. Good for Mango. It's good for him. Yeah. yeah. Alright, got the back throw. Oh no. Oh I really I really thought he was gonna get hit by the Jack was looking for cheese, but at the end he got Okay, he got me down. <laughs> that was a really good answer. Yeah. They played this stage earlier, and like, uh, Brad 
SD'd at the start of the match. And like, I was, I was talking about like how SD'ing at the start of the match is way worse than SD'ing at the end. Because like, it fucks your time mentality up, like for the rest of the match. It, is this top 8? It is. I mean, we only had about 10 Yeah, this is, a small, this is a small tournament, so <laughs> a lot of these, um, a lot of these games... Well, actually, I mean, well, Sam, yeah, a lot of the, um, a lot of games are top 8. Which really just means everyone made top 8. Well, no, everyone, but a lot of people made top 8. A lot of people are winners, and that's what matters. You know, everyone gets to go home feeling like they achieved something. Even if they went 1 and 2, they're like, well, I made top 8. Yeah. It's a tournament. Oh. Uh, Alright, now he can do it. But Flo's put up such a fight. Like, for a Sheik player, like, he is. Oh. Oh, okay. He's been playing, he's been playing Fox for a bit now. He's yeah, Nikita, it's not bad for our first, like, streamed IRL tournament in quite a while. I think yeah. the turnout is, like, it's pretty appealing. The thing is, it's like, it's gonna take a bit of time getting people. Yeah, it's for a bad. Yeah. <laughs> it's gonna take a bit of time getting people, you know, coming back. Also, this was a very late notice. Yeah, Honestly, super like, late notice. I found out this happening shout out last to, night. Yeah, <laughs> shout, out, shout out to the people that like actually showed up because like, yeah, it was, I think the announcement came out like Saturday. Yeah, about this. Um, super late. But like, oh yeah, hey guys, yeah, no, we're actually running melee for you see because we're like splitting up to um. Good job. Splitting the weeks because to reduce like the attendance in the rooms. Uh, 